What's going on, Pokemon Masters? Pong Chase, you're back today. What's my Pokemon Pro Wedlock? This is episode 16, and we are back today in the Veilstone City. And we're going to try doing a few things today, and I, I kept going on my bike. I don't like it. Uh, uh, this is a team. If you missed out on the ending of the last episode, basically, we got um, Chikorita to evolve into Bayleaf. We have Aces here, and we did a bit of grinding. Not all too much, but a bit of grinding. Ganon also learned Ice Shard, I believe. Ice Shard. Yeah, he learned Ice Shard, so now he's finally useful. I cannot believe it. It's about time. It is about time. Also, I'm probably never going to use Kwong. Um, I just realized that in the grinding the grinding montage. I'm probably never gonna use Kwong. So I'm sorry if Kwong gets way under leveled. I just I don't like him. I, I don't really compared to compared to Bayleaf. I would rather use a Bayleaf than Weepin' Bell. So yeah, this is that. And this is what our team's looking like at the moment. So six of them, the pair right here, pair right here, and pair right here. So it's pretty decent pairs in my opinion. And in Veilson City, there's actually quite a few things to do over here. There's actually a lot of things to do, so. Pokemon Center is right there, first of all. Second of all, right here is the Veilstone Department Store, a shop full of dreams. And you can go shop around in here if you want. They have pretty much anything you could want. I'm actually going to go ahead and shop in here. I want to see what they have. I want to see what they have to offer. Uh, we're going to go up to the next floor. I don't believe that there's anything in there, to be perfectly honest. Uh, what's over here? We're giving away the Pokech app. I can give you the Counter app. Ca okay, Counter app. We, we got another Poket app. I did not even think that was... All right, we got a, we got an app. We got an app. And let's talk to you. What do you need? Let's go ahead and buy. We can get uh, proteins and stuff like that. Things that I don't really need at the moment. Uh, let's talk to you. A bunch of X items. Uh, we're just going to stick away from those for now. Also, on this other side, what does this guy have? Can I help you on anything? What's recommended? All right. Good to know. Good to know. Let's see what's on the next level. On this level, there is... TMs. Okay. Uh, the user cloaks its body with a white mist that prevents any of its stats from being cut for five turns. All right, I don't think we need that. A seed that causes worry is planted on the food, prevents by making. Okay, so this is uh, this is worry seed. This is haze. I remember this is randomized. These are rampages for an attack for two to three turns. However, then it becomes confused. Is this outrage? No way. These are vibrates its wings to generate a damaging sound wave. It may also lower the foe's death stat. That's bug buzz, I believe. These are charges at the foe using every bit of its power. The user must rest. I believe that's Giga Impact. These are attacks a hurling blob of mud at the foe. It also reduces the target speed. What? <laughs> okay, so these are actually some pretty good items. Outrage and Bug Buzz are actually really good. Uh, let me see if um if I, anybody could use Outrage or Bug Buzz at the moment. I don't think so. Yeah, we don't have any Dragon types. We don't have any uh, Bug types. I don't think I'm going to get either one of them. I mean, I could give it to Zeon, but Zeon learns Signal Beam at some point, so I don't really want to waste money on that. Let's just see what's over here. This one, the user takes sure aim at the foe and ensures... Okay, I think that's Foresight. The user attacks the foe at full power. The attacks recoil sharply reduces the user's special attack stat. Is this overheat? I think that's overheat. The user goes to sleep for two to three turns. That's rest. A spray of bubbles is forcefully ejected at the foe. Is that bubble? Oh my gosh. The user pecks at the foe. Um, I think that's pluck. I think that's pluck. The user soaks itself with water. The move weakens fire type moves while the user is in battle. Okay, the foe is attacked with an intense blast of all consuming fire. It may also leave the target with a burn. All these TMs are amazing, but it's just I'm gonna buy this one because it's only it's not too much money. So we're gonna buy that one. It's only it's only a thousand. Might as well. We we are just swimming in the money right now. So we're gonna go uh, see if that which fire move that was. I know that's one of them. Fire blast. Oh my goodness. All right, so this fire blast. Um let me see. I, I'm not sure if I need any of these other ones. They're all amazing TMs right here. There's a bunch of amazing TMs. I really want them, but I just don't think I'm going to need all of them because th this is I, this is the reason I came here. Attacks of full of po power. The attack, I think that's overheat. I'm not sure. Let me just make sure that the colors are the same. Yeah, I think that's overheat. I think this one's overheat. Um, pretty sure that's overheat, but we don't have a fire type. If we had a fire type, this would be fantastic. That's not good. Pluck. I kind of want to give Pluck. You know, we're going to buy Pluck. Why not? It's only 2,000. May as well. It's only 2,000, so we have Pluck. This one, forcefully... That's Bubble. We're not teaching Bubble. Go to sleep for two to three turns. That's Rest. That's Overheat. Ensures the attack does not fail. That's a Force. Okay, so um, we're going to take a look just to make... No, I don't... I don't want to... I don't want to go on my bike, Rowan. Trust me. Uh, so let me just see. Which ones did we buy? Pluck. Yeah, that's right. Pluck, Pluck. So let's see if um, if LTD Valor can learn Pluck. He can't learn Pluck. I only bought Pluck to teach it to you. Wow. Okay, it's only 60 power. I mean, that's not the best, but still, I only bought Pluck to give it to you. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Well, we're just gonna we're just gonna get away from TMs for now. That's that's actually some really powerful TMs. Though. I'm happy with those. Pretty happy with those TMs. Uh, let's go see what's over here. 
What do you need? Let's go buy yellow cushion. All these things that we're just not ever going to need at the moment. Let's talk to you. A bunch of dollars. I believe these are for secret bases um, that when you go underground and stuff. Well, they're not called secret bases. Whatever they're called, when you go underground, uh, that's what they're for. And this is actually the top level, I believe. Um, do you have to say anything? A regular. All right. Sticky barb. We got the sticky barb already then. I did not know that we were going to get a sticky barb. Is a whole item. The Pokemon is holding it. The sticky barb allows the foe to inflict the damage. Is that like rocky helmet kind of? I think that's kind of like the rocky helmet. Um, all right. And right here, can we actually buy some drinks? It's a vending machine. Yeah, we can actually buy a bunch of drinks in here. Um, we might as well buy a few. You only can buy one at a time, which is really unfortunate. It's kind of like the Moomoo Milk, um, but it, it doesn't take as long, I guess. So that's kind of kind of nice, but it's just not... It takes way too long. It takes way too long. We're just going to get one of each, because why not? I want one of each. I want to have the variety in my life right now. Okay, let's exit that out. And then uh, I'm actually going to use the elevator, since we didn't use the elevator last time. We're going to use the elevator to get all the way out of here. Actually, I think we can go to... Thank you for chopping with us. We can actually go... No, we can't. Dang it. Okay, we're going to go down to one floor. I thought there was going to be like an underground place that we can go to, but that's not in this area. That's in a different area. So we're just going to we're just gonna leave it right there for now. We're just going to leave it right there. We're going to get out of here. And yeah, so we can't go underground uh, another level just yet. It's not, actually, I don't even think it's in this area. I think it's in a different area. I don't know. So let's... <laughs> we're done with there. We're done with there. There's actually some pretty nice TMs in there, though. So that's pretty cool. Um, over here, another thing, another thing to note is that there's actually meteorites, and if you have Deoxys, uh, Deoxys will change forms if you talk to the meteorites. They're just gonna say something, and Deoxys is gonna change form, and if you have Deoxys, you might as well do it, and there's some Team Galactic people, which we don't like! We don't associate ourselves with Team Galactic, and right here, I believe this is the game corner. Yep, this is the Veilstone game corner, and let's talk to you. A coin case, there's a clown giving him away, ooh, a clown, okay, let's see, clown. Clown, we gotta find a clown. We are on the hunt for the clown. Um, you kind of look like a clown. Just kidding, just kidding. You don't look like a clown, I'm just kidding. Um, I don't know where this clown is. I have no idea. Uh, I have <laughs> no idea. Uh, I think, th actually I think the clown is inside the Veilstone game corner, but I think you get embargo from somebody, that's why. Hidden machine that teaches fly in the warehouse. Oh no, oh no, that's, okay, well we get fly from him. I think this guy gives us embargo. I think it was this guy. I should have talked to him. I knew I should have talked to him. I think he gives us embargo. Meteorites, nothing to do anything, but take this technical machine. TM 63, a bunch of TMs today. That's nice. I like getting TMs. Embargo, but it's not embargo. It's not embargo. It's randomized. Randomized, though. We're going to go to bag. It's TM 63, I believe. Charge beam. That's actually not bad. I could give that. I could give that to Xeon, but... He learns Discharge soon, so I'm just going to stick away from giving that to Zeon for now. I don't even know if he can learn it, because remember, the randomized and such. So we're going to go inside the game corner. Um, there's a clown in here that we need to talk to. We need to talk to the clown. Uh, where is this clown? Isn't there a clown? Clown in a house. Oh, it's in a house. It's not in a game corner house. Dang it. Okay. Uh, west. Never. Okay. Northeast. Southwest. West over here. Okay. Uh, we're going to go over here. I believe it's in this house. Should be in this house. Yes! All right, here's the clown. Let's talk to you. Watch the coin. Spin, 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 spin. Which hand is the coin? Left or right? It's in the left. Bravo! Bravo, bravo. And we get the coin case, and now we can place bets, and we can do all the fun stuff that we could have never done before. <laughs> it hurts. Okay. <laughs> So now we can actually go to the game corner. We can play some games, but we're not gonna do that Also, if you didn't notice there's uh, this little rock climb area right here. Oh Well up there you can rock climb and you can get full incense Trip, are you going to take the gym challenge? G, you keep getting tougher and tougher, don't you? Me? Well, I went shopping at the department store and I mean, well, of course I've been working on my Pokedex, but I'll catch you later And then Don leaves so good talking to you Don. It's actually been a while since we've seen Don, so that's kind of cool um, Let's see we can get a tiny mushroom over there Okay, I'm gonna get some hidden items. So we can get a tiny mushroom west of the warehouse, just north of the city entrance. Okay, so it's this it's this place. Not this place, it's this way. Uh, this way some... Oh no, we already got that tiny mushroom. Okay, so PP up on the west side of the Galactic Veilstone building. All right, I believe also there is another galactic area, not where those two people were guarding, but over here, this away. There's actually another one, and um, we got to go to this side, and right here, there's going to be a PP up that we can get. Yep, there it is. There's a PP up, and we can get a revive between the trees and the Veilstone department store. Between what? 
between the trees and Veilstone department store. Okay, I think it's over here. Trees and Veilstone department store. There's trees right here. Or do you mean these trees? It's probably these trees. There we go. Okay, there's a revive right there. I didn't even need to use. I didn't even need to use the dowsing machine. So we got a revive right there. Uh, calcium, that's in. Okay, that's in. The rest of the items are in platinum. I'm planning to find a couple more items in there. But that is all the items that we can get at the moment. We can get HMO2 fly, like that Galactic guy said. But that's later on. Not just quite yet. So we're just going to head on into the gym. Because as you saw, there was a gym over here. And we're going to go into the gym. And we're going to get ourselves a gym badge. I hope. I hope. I hope. Actually, before, before I get in there, before I go into there, let's go right here and talk to the sign. Veilson City Pokemon Gym Leader Maylene. The Barefoot Fighting Genius, and usually this is a fighting type gym, but this is randomized, so it's not going to be a fighting type gym. Hey there, how's it going, champ to be? The gym leader is a user of fighting type Pokemon. She'd be a terror against normal type Pokemon. But, and it's a big but just between you and me, mainly the gym leader said flying and psychic type Pokemon could be real trouble for her. Alright, so basically we have a lot of people to battle right now. I'm going to go ahead and battle them. I'm going to speed these up, and while we battle those people, might as well talk about uh, the game corner. The game corner, I believe you can get... Um, you get a few Pokemon, I think, from the game corner. I'm not quite sure. Let me, let me see this up. Let me see this, uh, this Zatu's in here. Uh, I believe we can just astonish. Uh, me first. You're gonna astonish me before I can astonish you. Are you kidding me? I better not flinch. Oh my gosh! Critical hit! Calm down! And we flinch! Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh. Alright, we're gonna go out to Ganon. Wow, that did so much, Fowler. Oh my goodness. Okay. So, Ganon's in here. He's going to use Miracle Eye. What does Miracle Eye even do? You identified me. Congratulations. So, we're going to use Ice Shard. I cannot believe that. How did that do so much? The crit. Crit was unbelievable. That's going to do like nothing. Confuse Ray. Oh my gosh. Ganon's pretty much not going to be as good until he evolves, to be perfectly honest. He's not really going to be that good until he evolves. Uh, he's going to land it, though. There we go. There we go. Uh, so, what was I going to talk about? I was going to talk about the. The. What is it? The Veilstone, the Veilstone Game Corner. So, let me let me see these things. You can get, you can play. You can get a po you can get a Clefairy to pop out of the Pokeball. I don't know. I'm just reading this off the thing. I have no idea. I have no idea. You can buy 50 coins for a thousand dollars. I guess you can buy 500 coins for ten thousand dollars. I believe it's kind of fair. So you at the prize exchange though, uh, you can get a few things. Of course, the TMs are going to be randomized. Actually, I should check up on those TMs. I should check up on those TMs to see what they are. I should do that after because if they're good TMs, I kind of want them. Uh, pseudo Wudo. Um, we're gonna go out into Aces. Aces should do well against Pseudo Wudo. And I know we're kind of actually under leveled for this gym, but it's fine. It should, we should be fine. I hope. I hope we're fine. I think her Ace is level thirty. I believe her Ace is level thirty. So we may have to use Lucky. I know I haven't been using Lucky all too much because Lucky is just overpowered. I don't really want to use something that's so overpowered, you know. So uh, at the prize exchange, we can get Silk Scarf, Wide Lens, Zoom Lens. Metronome, you can get so many TMs. The rest of them are just a bunch of TMs. And, of course, they're randomized for us. So, we don't really need to worry about those all too much. I can't wait until Zion evolves, though. I really can't wait. Uh, I thought you could get Pokemon here. Can you get some Pokemon? Um, I don't think you can. I thought you could. I guess you can't. All right. I guess you can't get any Pokemon. I thought you'd be able to. I think that's only in... Uh, Okay, we're gonna speed this up. I thought that was, I think that's only in Shedinja. Are you kidding me? Do we even have anything to hit the thing? Oh, we have Astonish. Okay, we have Astonish. Um, but I don't, I don't really want to keep you in when you're at this, this low health. Um, he's Bug Ghost, Bug Ghost. Uh, Ice isn't super effective on Bug. Our Valor is our only way to hit this thing. Oh my gosh. All right, what I'm gonna do is go out into Zeon. I'm gonna go for the Thunder Wave, and then I'm gonna heal up Valor. Because I don't want to keep Valor in there when he's at low health. He's just gonna stand attack under. Okay, all right. Alrighty then, uh, we're gonna go for the thunder. Actually, I can just go for the confused right because it will hit him because it's a ghost type move. Uh, it should hit him at least. I hope it does. So we're gonna do that. He's gonna use spite. I'm fine with that. I can just heal up. It's not a PP lock or anything like that. We're gonna go for the confused ray. We land it. You just need to smack yourself one time. One time, Shedinja. One time, Shedinja. Dang it. <laughs> Dang it, Shedinja. One time, you need to smack yourself. Let's not do that. Let's go. Uh, let's go ahead and heal up. We might, might as well. Uh, we're gonna use a super potion because we have a lot more super potions. Heal up Valor a little bit. Smack yourself, Shedinja. Dang it. Why are you keep spiting me? I don't care if you spite Confused Ray, but still, stop spiting me. We're gonna heal up again. We just need the Shedinja to smack himself once because he only has one HP. Paralyzed. Are you kidding me, Shedinja? One time. All right, I'm gonna go into Valor. I'm gonna go out into Valor because this is just this is gonna take way too long. It's just gonna take way. He's probably gonna smack himself now. 
No, he's snapped out. And he's gonna fear size, but it doesn't affect us. Haha, <laughs> we got you. Now we're gonna use Astonish. Should just drop his HP. It does. Actually, I thought that would just go from one to zero, but I guess not. I guess not. Oh well. Oh well. Dusknor is not is up next. Okay. Dusknor is kind of a problem. Um, we're gonna get to Zeon. We're gonna get to Zeon. We can find a way, we can confuse Ray, and then we can just water gun this thing to death. Uh that Dusknor is actually really, really bulky. He is so bulky, so I, I don't know how this is going to go. We're going to Thunder Wave. I have no idea what moveset Dusknoir has. We're actually the same level. Zeon and Dusknoir are the same level. Wow. Astonish, don't do a lot. Oh, that did way too much. We're going to use Confuse right now. So we have Confuse right and Thunder Wave off on this thing. You shouldn't be able to attack us. I wish we had, like, Headbutt on this thing, too. Come on. Well, actually, Headbutt doesn't even affect this, so... Okay, Zeon Pursuit. All right, I, I kind of want to heal up. Um, I'm not going to heal up yet, though. I'm going to go for the Water Gun. Oh, we have 4 to 1 HP left. That's gonna do nothing, and he snaps out of confusion. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. All right, I'm gonna go swap out into Ganon, I think. Yeah, I'm gonna swap out to Ganon. Ganon is our uh, second highest level. I don't wanna go out to Lucky because he has Astonish and he has Pursuit, and that's just not, <laughs> not a good time. We're gonna use Ice Shard. Should do a little bit. It's probably not gonna do too much. Yeah, that does nothing. We have Shell Ball, though, so all that does it recovers pretty much nothing. He's gonna use to Pursue. I kind of want to heal up now. Yeah, I'm gonna heal up because a crit would take us out. I believe a crit would take us out, so I'm gonna go and heal up. I don't want to throw a Pokeball. Uh, we want to use Super Potion. That's what we want to do. We're gonna heal up. Oh, that's full HP. This Dust is actually scary. This gym is gonna be hard. This is gonna be a hard gym. He's paralyzed again. This is also probably gonna be a long episode. So uh, I just want to apologize about that before anything. Uh, we've been having some pretty long episodes lately, so oh, that does nothing. Shadow Snake 2, you have such a good moveset. Oh my gosh, Shadow Snake did so much. Shadow Snake did so much. Alright, we're gonna Ice Shard, get a crit. Critical hit. Nope. Shell Bell, though. We only get one HP with the Shell Bell. Stop this nonsense. Don't do a lot. Oh my gosh, critical hit. Can you not? Can you not? Can you not? We need to heal up because he does have Pursue. Can you not? Can you not, Dustin War? Can you not? Paralyzed, not even bad. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna go for the ice shard now. Uh, I cannot believe that did so much with the crit. That actually scared me. Uh, that actually scared me. And we get our own crit. Not bad. There goes the dust snore. That is nice. Good times everywhere. Good times everywhere. I probably should have done a little bit of grinding before we take on this gym, but whatever. Might as well struggle a little bit, right? Why not? Uh, we're gonna go out to Zeon. I don't think Gyarados gets anything to. Oh, he gets he gets Dragon Rage, but we have 41, and he gets guard. Okay, um, we're gonna go for the Thunder Wave. No, we're not. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. We're gonna spark. It's four times effective. Four times effective. We are faster than Gyarados. This is four times effective. I know we're intimidated. Oh, that does nothing. He's gonna bite. Okay, we need to heal up. No, that did so much. Oh my gosh, that did so much. Oh my gosh, that did so much. That did so much. Alright, there's no way this thing gets pursuit. Oh, that did so much. Okay, we can go out into Val. Oh, but bite super effective. I think we're gonna have to Kuang. Kuang, this is your time to shine, Kuang. I should have went for the Thunder Wave. This is your time to shine, Kuang. This is your time. He's gonna bite again. That's fine. Eat it up. Oh, that is not eating it up. That is. Oh, we don't have. Oh, I thought we had something. I thought we had something. Okay, I can acid. Hope for the. Conf... Hope for the poison. I can heal up Zeon. All right, this is kind of scary. This is kind of scary. Um, what's your defense like? Forty-eight defense. I want to find out who's. What's your defense? 32, but you do have more, well, you have less HP than Aces at the moment. I think, I think, I think, what's your defense? 56. I think we're going to get to Lucky. Yeah, I don't think, I don't think he's going to bite again. I hope he doesn't bite again. We're going to go out into Lucky. Um, I want to see how much a bite does. I want to see how much a bite does. Dragon Rage. Okay, all right. It's going to do, actually does quite a bit. Okay, we're going to go for the... We're gonna go for the side beam. We should ask me this thing. We ask me this thing. We go for the side beam. Please knock it out. No! We got a confusion. Yes, yes. Smack yourself. Smack yourself. Smack yourself, Gyarados. Yes! Okay. That is amazing. That was actually a really close battle. Gyarados, Dusknor, and Zatu. Or I think Zatu was on the other guy. I don't remember. He had some really, really good Pokemon, though. Wow. Okay. That's kind of scary. I kind of want to go heal up. I think I'm gonna go heal up. Um, because we still have two more trainers. Oh, I did not want to move. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to run ahead. I'm going to run ahead and heal up. I will be right back. Also, I'm going to go check the game corner, actually. Before before I cut or anything, I want to go check the game corner just to see what TMs they have at the game corner. 
Uh, this is going to be a pretty long episode. Oh my goodness. We're going to go to the game corner, which, yeah, it's right here. Okay. Uh, we're going to go in here. Let's see what TMs they have. There's just so much TMs today. Let's talk to you. Welcome to the Veil Zone. Do you want some coins? To 1,000. No, I don't want coins. I want to exchange. I want to exchange. Okay, I can't exchange in here, I don't think. I don't think I can exchange in there now. I think we need to go and exchange in this area. This is the prize exchange. Yeah, okay. I should have just went in here. Should have just went in here. Let's talk to you. Fabulous prizes. We have the Silk Scarf, Y Lens, Zoom Lens, Metronome, TM90. Toxic. Um, that's not bad. 58. Psych Up. That's not too bad. 75. Endeavor. That's pretty bad. <laughs> that is pretty bad. Uh, 32. Heal Order. That's... Uh, I don't really... I don't think Heal Order is a move for in-game. False Swipe. Uh, that's good for catching Pokemon, but it's not really the best. TM89. Swagger. What is with these horrible TMs? TM10. Discharge. Ooh, that's not too bad. We do... Uh, he does learn Discharge. Zion learns Discharge soon, so... Thunder Fang. We already have Thunder Fang. Uh, TM21. 21. Metal Burst. We're not going to teach it Metal Burst. TM35. U-turn, that's not bad, but I'm going to stick away from U-turn for now. TM35, eh, oh, that it was U-turn. Okay, that was TM35. There's so many items here. Uh, TM20, I, like I said, there's a lot. Needle arm, that's not bad. That's not bad. Uh, so we went 35, 24, 13. Sing, that's, that's pretty bad. Can I just go up? No, I can't go up. Dang it. All right, we got to go. So 35, 24, 13, 29. Flail, I'll pass on flail. Uh, TM74, Ice Fang, that's not bad, um, that's not bad, TM74 I think it was, that's not bad, was it 74, yeah it was 74, but that's 15,000 coins, there's no possible way I'm doing that, there's no, po absorb, that is, okay, there's no possible way I'm gonna do that, though, I would get Ice Fang for Ganon, but there's just no possible way I'm gonna get that many coins, so, I know, actually, I think he learns Ice Fang, but I think it's a move, it's a really learned move, so, yeah, okay, I'm gonna go heal up, and I'll see you guys back in the Veilstone Gym. Okay, we are back, and I was pressing command on accident. Whoops, I need to, all right, press back. There we go, okay. Oh, no. Okay, all right, all right, fix it. I have no idea what that was. But we're just going to battle people again. Also, I didn't even ask for the question of the day, so. Whoa, hi-ya, hope! Um, <laughs> so question of the day for today, since we did a bit of shopping, he only has one Pokemon. Well, it's a Wingle. All oh, power. Power. 28. That is power. Uh, since I didn't ask for a question of the day yet, question of the day for today, since I did some shopping earlier, uh, do you like to go shopping a lot, and uh, do you shop, how often do you shop, and just give me everything, give me the whole rundown of your shopping careers, your shopping life, do we really, oh, I cannot believe we just did that, uh, so we found a Wingle and a Gyarados in the gym, yeah, give me the whole rundown, of course we smack ourselves, of course, Give me the whole rundown, whether you like shopping, whether you don't like shopping, all that stuff. Me, personally, I don't really like... Can you stop smacking yourself, Zion? Are you kidding me? Oh, my gosh. It's like a 10% chance you smack yourself twice. Twice. Can you please not hit yourself? Thank you. Oh, my gosh. But, yeah, I personally, I don't like shopping that much. I like shopping when it's for me. I don't really like shopping for other people all too much. I just, I don't really like it. I don't know why. Um, but I like doing Christmas shopping because it's like that you're giving somebody for Christmas. Stuff like that I like. But I just don't really like shopping. Just in general. Shopping is just weird. How do we battle this last guy? I think we just go over there. Shopping is just weird to me. I don't know. I just don't really like shopping all too much. It's, to me, it's kind of like a waste of time, really. I just don't, I don't find a need. Well, it's not a waste of time, but I just don't find a need for it most of the time because, I mean, what do you shop for? Like clothes? I guess food. Food, of course, that like you have to shop for food. But I mean, shopping for other things. There's just not too much of a point. I can't believe we just found a fee bass. There's really not too much of a point, in my opinion. Oh, we're just going to gust this thing. Splash. Oh, what power. What power. We're just going to gust this. I just don't like shopping too much. I don't know what it is. It's just, it's not really my thing. Shopping's not really my thing. So we're going to keep gusting. The thing I noticed with our team, though, at the moment, our team's actually looking pretty bulky. We have some pretty bulky Pokemon, like Meganium. Well, it's going to be a Meganium, hopefully, going to be a Lantern, hopefully, and we have a, this thing right here, we have Valor, we have a Drifloom, and that's a lot of, uh, that's actually a lot of bulk, and we have Grumpig, too, that's so much bulk, so Torchic, 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 uh, I kind of want to get to Zeon, we're just going to stay with Valor, Valor needs some levels right now, Valor really needs some levels, the thing, I gave uh, Zeon the XP share because I want Zeon to evolve as soon as possible, he evolves at level, what is it, 28, 29, something like that he evolves, so we're almost there to evolve Zeon up, we're almost there. Accuracy is gonna drop. Can you can you land it? One I one sand attack. You're already missing. You're already missing after one sand attack. Are you kidding, Valor? Are you fluffy kidding me right now? That did nothing. 
It's doing nothing. Oh my goodness, crit. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? We're gonna not go out to aces. We're gonna go out to Zeon. Wow, that crit did so much. We're gonna go out to Zeon. I know he's four levels higher than me, but still, it's a Torchic. It's a little baby Torchic. Uh, we're gonna go for the water gun, land it. Are you missed? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, Zeon? Crit again! This Torchic is the most annoying thing ever. Oh my gosh, Torchic. I'm healing up. I don't even want to deal with this. I'm not Pokeball. I'm healing up. We're going to use that super potion. I cannot believe this Torchic. Can you just, like, stop? Turn down. Relax. Relax. It's not that serious. Peck is also resisted. It's not that serious, Torchic. Please. It's not that serious. All right, we're going to go for the water gun if you can land it. Thank you, Zeon. Thank you. And Torchic's going to go down. Not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. And I think, was that, does he have another Pokemon? He does. He has a Volbeat. Um... Bullbeats is bug type. We can go out to Valor. Okay, I'm gonna go out to Valor. Uh, Valor should actually. I don't think Valor is gonna be able to one shot him. <laughs> I really don't. I don't think Valor is. Gonna, I, I don't know what this Bullbeats gonna do. I have no idea. Bullbeats doesn't have the best moves. I'm just gonna go for Gust. Tail Glow. Oh my goodness. Alrighty then. Relax. Calm down. It is not that serious. It's not even a two KO. Oh my gosh. All right, we're gonna heal up. We're gonna heal up. We're gonna use a super potion. I have no idea what move set this thing has. I have honestly no idea. I just burped. I'm sorry if you guys heard that. Signal Beam. All right, that's four times resisted it is. Yeah, that does nothing. Even at plus three, that's four times resisted. Oh, he's going to use Moonlight. Oh, Volbeat. Don't do this right now. Don't do this, Volbeat. Moonlight, Tail Glow, Signal Beam. We've seen three of his moves. Don't do this to me, Volbeat, please. Don't. I don't think you can really touch Valor, but it's just... Don't do this, please. Moonlight again. You, I just attacked you once. Volbeat, please. Please, Volbeat, don't do this to me. I know he only has five moonlights, but still, I don't want to wait for him to use all five of his moonlights. Oh my gosh, we're gonna gust. Moonlight again? Are you kidding, Volby? This man is the most annoying trainer of all time. Can you not do this to me right now? You're seriously just wasting so much of my time. Can you please get a crit? Yes, not even bad. Not even bad. We're gonna use gust again. Oh my gosh, Volbeat! Can you stop? You are so irritating right now. You are so irritating. I hate this. Yeah, there we go. Crit. Not even bad. Get out of my face, Volby. Get out of my face. I hate you so much. I hate you so much. Valor's going to level up. Not bad. Valor's going to try and learn Stockpile. I'm not going to teach him Stockpile. I don't really find a point in Stockpile. Xeon is going to get some uh, experience too. And we defeated this annoying, annoying trainer. And I'm going to heal up, I believe. Uh, how much well, How much damage did we even take? Uh, we didn't... Yeah, we didn't take that much. Uh, we're going to heal up. Two potions should be good. It's not going to get Valor up to full, but it's going to get him... Almost up to full, so we're just going to use that. Yeah, it's one away from full. It's pretty much full. Also, I'm not going to lead with Valor because it's a gym battle. I'm going to lead with... I'm going to lead with... I think I'm... I, probably, I can just sweep the gym with Lucky, most likely. But I don't know if I really want to do that because that's not all too much fun. I think I'm going to lead Zeon. I'm going to lead Zeon. If he doesn't have a lead with the Grass type, then we should be good. Okay, how are we going to get through this gym? How are we going to get through this gym? I have no idea. So we need to get through up here from the top. Oh, we need to push that one on the right. Okay, all right, here we go. Uh, we're gonna leave that where it is. We're just gonna run here. I think we push this. Uh, we go over here. We push that. I actually really like the idea of this gym. I wish they did another gym that's kind of like this because personally, I think this is an amazing idea for a gym. It's an amazing concept, really. Uh, now we go over here. We move this. We go over here. Move that all the way down there. Slide that bad boy. I think actually in Platinum, the, this gym is like with punching bags. And then you like move the punching bags. I think that's also really cool. I really like what they do with the Veilstone gym, really. I really like what they did with it. Now we move over here and move that. So there we go. One of them is moved. We only have one more to go. That is one on the other side. So we're going to run to the other side. Oh, we didn't even talk to this thing. Veilstone City Pokemon Gym Leader Maylene. Certified Trainer is Daniel. Of course Daniel will be here already. Of course. Of course. Oh, we're going to move this over there. Also going to go over here and move that. And we're going to go over here and move that. I believe. I believe. I think that's what we do. I think that... Can you go down there? Oh my gosh, Trip. Trip! Oh, man. Okay, we're going to move this out of the way. I think... I, I'm pretty sure I battled him already. I really hope I battled him already. Move that. Uh, we're going to go up here and move that. We're going to go down here. And that... I believe that cleared the path for us. Yeah, we did battle him. Okay, that cleared the path for us. We can move over here. And now we can just go straight down over here. And go, if I can get through the door, we can go over here, talk to the litter, the leader, the litter, talk to the litter, talk to the leader, Maylene, right here. I don't know how I'm supposed to stand. Maybe, maybe like this? I don't know. Screenshot material? Possibly. Okay, now we're going to talk to you. Hello. I'm pleased to meet you. I'm Maylene, and I'm the gym leader. 
I don't really know what it means to be strong or how I got to be the gym leader. But I will do the best I can as the gym leader. I take battling very seriously. Whenever you're ready. And here we go. We're battling leader Maylene. Gym leader Maylene. And she's actually, her name's going to be randomized. What is it going to be randomized to? Champion Lilina. Oh my gosh. We're already facing the champion. And she leads with a Diglett. That is like the one Pokemon I did not want her to lead with. Okay. This is bad. This is really bad. This is really, really bad. Um, oh, this is really, really bad. Can we swap? Don't have Arena Trap. Yes! No Arena Trap. Woo! Okay, I got scared. I got really, really scared right there. Uh, he's going to go for Dig. All right, that is fine. That is fine. I am so glad that we can run away. I should have just led with Lucky. I don't know why I didn't. We're just going to side him. I mean, we're faster. Uh, well, I'm not speeding this battle up because this is, a, this is a gym battle. Also, in the regular games, Maylene actually has a... She actually has a Lucario, and that is her ace at level 30, Lucario, and that's really cool. If you did not know, Lucario is actually one of my favorite Pokemon, so uh, I really love Lucario. And Psybeam's just going to one-shot this thing because of a crit. I think that crit mattered, but I don't really care. It's just a, just a gym leader. I don't care, gym. I don't care, gym leader. I get the crits, all the crits. I'll get every single crit, I won't even care. Uh, Houndoom, okay. All right, I think we're going to go out into Zeon. Yeah, we're gonna get Zeon. I really wish Ganon had Thick Fat. I would be more confident in going out to Ganon because he's a ground type, but I can't really send him out on fire types because he kind of has the he's kind of has a weakness to fire. So how oh, hound do him? I thought it was Hound Hour. Okay, this is her ace. <laughs> this is her ace. I'm gonna go for the Thunder Wave. Oh, I'm just gonna go for the bites. That's gonna do a bit, actually. Oh my gosh, that did so much. Crit would actually knock us out. Okay, we're gonna Thunder Wave. Okay, we need to get out of here. We need to get out of here. I really hope he doesn't have pursuit. Really, really hope he doesn't or she does not have pursuits. Uh, we're gonna swap out. Who do we? Oh, we can't swap it to anybody. Dark types destroy our team. Dark fire destroys our team. Oh my gosh, Zion is the only thing, but Zion cannot take a hit. Oh no. All right. Ganon. Ganon is not taking a special hit at all. Ganon is not. I think we have to go out to Kuang right now. I think we have to. Kuang is not gonna take a hit though. Twenty-eight defense is horrible. Oh my, we can't even hit him with lucky. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. We're going to go out to Kuang. Don't pursue. Yes. All right. No pursuit. No pursuit. We're going to go out into Kuang. Get paralyzed. Yes. All right. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, I wish we went to Ganon now, but I think we actually need to sack off Kuang, which is really, really bad. That is really... I'm going to use the Super Potion to heal Zeon up. I have a feeling that we're going to need to go back out to Zeon. I, I think I need to sack off Kuang. I am really, really sorry. He's going to use Roar. Okay. Roar me out into Zeon or Ganon. Oh, this is Aces. Oh, not Aces. This is the one that I didn't want to be Roared out into. Uh, okay. We're going to go right back into Kuang. Right back into Kuang. Uh, I know he might use a Fire type move right now. I guess I could go into Lucky and just Confuse Ray, but he has Bite. So it's super effective and it's Stab and it's a Houndoom. So it's really not the best thing to do. It's really not the best thing to do. We're just going to go for Acid. We're just going to ask it right now. See how much it does. Hopefully it does a little bit. Doesn't do anything really. Uh, he's paralyzed. I wish I went out to Ganon right there. Whenever he's paralyzed. But I don't want to take a fire type hit. I don't even know if he has a fire type move. I just don't want to take a fire type hit. We saw Roar. We saw Bite. We see Paralyzed. We see. We saw two, two of his moves right now. We saw two of his moves. Uh, I just I want to figure out what his other two moves are. I guarantee he has at least Ember. I guarantee he has at least Ember. Beat up. Floatzel. Floatzel in the back. Are you kidding me? And Floatzel got a crit. Are you kidding, Floatzel? Houndoom's attack. It's not going to do much. Okay, so we've seen most of his moves. I don't think he has a fire type move, actually. I don't think he has a fire type move. I don't think he does. Kuang actually might come useful because he may not have a fire type move. He's going to use Bite. Oh, no. Okay, I, I spoke too soon. Oh, okay, then. That's just one shot, Kuang. <laughs> Alrighty, then. So, Kuang is down. Uh, we just lost Kuang. I am sorry. <laughs> There goes Zeon's partner. Well, I don't know. I wasn't going to use Kuang all too much. I was talking trash about Kuang earlier. I'm sorry, Kuang. I didn't want you to go down like that. I really That wasn't the way I wanted to see you go down. That was really not the way I wanted you to go down. But I'm sorry, Kuang. A moment of silence for our fallen comrade, Kuang. You done good, Kuang. You done good. We're going to use Mud Bomb now. And we should be able to hopefully one-shot this Houndoom. I can't, I can't believe I lost Kuang, though. What? He's alive. Please. Please, no Ember. No Ember. Paralyze. I'll take that. I'll take that. I will take that. Uh, I may just go for the Mud Slap. No, it's not going to knock him. I'm going to Mud Bomb. Dang it. Hyper Potion. Ah. Oh. Okay. Uh, this is not good. We're still not in the clear yet. We're going to Mud Bomb. We're still not in the clear yet. We're still not in the clear yet. Can we please, please get off all the damage? 
That does nothing. Oh my god. Oh, we're gonna lower his accuracy. Accuracy is gonna drop. Yes, 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 yes. We're gonna mud bomb again. We land it. Can we get a critical hit? Can we get a crit? I'm still so scared of this Houndoom. Can we get a critical hit? No crit. Oh, please. Please, 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 please. Beat up. Okay, all right. It doesn't look like this Houndoom has a fire type attack. I am so glad this Houndoom does not have a fire type attack. I am so unbelievably glad. I'm gonna use Mud Slap and then Mud Bomb. I am so glad. His Mud Slap is gonna lower his accuracy and he has a chance to miss this next hit, so that's why. It's gonna do nothing. Oh my gosh, that does nothing. Why? Wow, that does literally nothing. Are right, we gonna get the Shell Bell recovery? This is such a scary battle. This is such a long episode too. I am sorry. I'm sorry for the really, really long episode. He might, he may use Bite right now. Actually, I kind of want to heal up. I actually really want to heal up. We're only at 45 HP. I'm gonna go ahead and use the Super Potion. I'm kind of scared for Ganon right now, so we're gonna heal up. Use the Super Potion. Use that Super Potion. I think does Floatzel. We saw Floatzel as his next Pokemon or her next Pokemon. So does Floatzel? He is gonna use Bite. I knew it. How much is that gonna do? Oh my gosh. That does so much! I use... Okay, we just... I think we have to try... We have to try and just... Healing up. She can get paralyzed and she can miss. So, we need to hope for either of those. We have... We dropped her accuracy by twice. By twice. We dropped her accuracy twice. So, she has a really good chance of missing. And she's also paralyzed. So, either of those would really be nice right now. We get to paralyze this. There we go. There we go. I'm gonna mud slap and then mud bomb. Uh, because I don't think a Mud Bomb is going to be able to take out this Houndoom from where it's at right now. But judging by how much damage it did the last time. And that, that yeah, now it should be enough to take it out. We're going to lower the Agassi one more time. Chance to miss, chance to get paralyzed. Uh, going to use Order Sleuth. Alright, that's fine by me. So Order Sleuth was the last move. So we actually could have went out to Aces. And Aces, Aces kind of walled them. But it's a Fire type. I didn't, I thought it would have Ember. I can't believe it didn't have Ember. Well, if it had Ember, it would have just one shot again. But I cannot believe it didn't have Ember. I am so happy it did not have Ember. I am so happy with that. So down goes the Houndoom. Down goes the Houndoom. Zeon's gonna get a ton of experience. Ace is gonna get a little bit of experience. And Ganon is also gonna get some experience. Everybody's just getting experience right now. Next up is Floatzel. We could go out to Aces, but Aces is really underleveled. So I'm gonna go into Lucky. I actually could've gone out to Zeon. It's fine. Lucky, Lucky should be able to clean up the job here. Should be able to clean up the job here. Champion Lolina. And this is gonna be our third badge if we can do this. This is going to be our third badge, level 27. Oh, but this isn't the end, my friend. And we're just gonna go with a side beam right now. Gonna use the Aqua Jet. We will eat that Aqua Jet up like it's delicious. That actually did a little bit more than I thought. I thought it would do like 10 damage max. I think it did 16 damage. We're gonna side beam. It should be a two hit KO because we're four levels above. Yeah, that's a two hit KO. That is a two hit KO. I'm in a bit of a bind, aren't I? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. And he's gonna just go for the Aqua Jet again. Last ditch effort. Maybe gets the Mega Crit. Nope, no Mega Crit. And we're gonna side beam and we're gonna finish this up. Lucky. Come in clutch. I'm so glad that that Diglett didn't have Arena Trap. That would have been horrible for us. It would have been absolutely horrible. Zeon gained 514 experience. Zeon is going to level up. Not bad. Lucky's also going to gain some experience. And we defeated Champion Lelina. I shall admit defeat. You are much too strong. And we get $3,600. And Zeon is going to be evolving. Yes, Zeon. Yes, Zeon. Do it, Zeon. Do it, Zeon. So there we go, we have Lantern, finally we have Lantern, and Lantern is trying to learn Stockpile. I'm actually not going to teach him Stockpile because it's not really, it's not really one of my favorite moves, so we're just going to give up on Stockpile and he's trying to learn Swallow. Stockpile and Swallow, not a bad combination, but it's not my, it's not my cup of tea, so we're not going to learn that either. And we have a Lantern, a spit up, are you kidding? Zeon, now is not the time, now is not the time, Zeon. So we're not going to learn spit up, and we have Lantern, I'm actually happy about that. Okay, you win, that was a tough loss, I learned a lot from it. Please, accept this gym badge. Trip received the cobble badge for Maylene. Yeah! Um, I should explain about that badge. If you have that official Pokemon League badge, you can use the hidden machine hidden move fly outside of battle. Oh, and please take this as well. We obtained TM60. It's randomized, so we're gonna go see what TM that is. Helping hand. Okay, then. Alrighty, then. Helping hand. We don't even need to check. That's a horrible move. Uh, we're gonna check... Ah, oh, we lost Kuang. I'm actually really mad that we lost Kuang, but oh well. Zeon has 111 hit points now. Wow. That is amazing. That is honestly amazing. I'm going to give the EXP share to Valor now. No, we're not going to switch. We're going to give him the EXP share. Go down over here to EXP share. Nope, it's another section. All right. 
Right here, XP share, we're gonna give it to Valor. And now Xeon actually does not have a partner. So we're gonna try finding a partner for Xeon soon. Let's take a look at Xeon's stats now. It's all around stats. Timid nature, of course, we know stats are actually looking pretty nice compared to a few other members like Lucky. 56 defense, 42, but 111 HP. Just that lets you take any hit you want. Illuminate still, which is terrible, but it's fine. Is uh, Lucky still our fastest Pokemon? I don't understand that, but whatever. <laughs> whatever. So here's Zeon. I'm, I'm really happy with Zeon. I'm really happy. I'm really happy getting, finally getting a Lantern. Finally, so much HP too, so much more bulk. So much more bulk, I'm really happy with that. We're just gonna get out of this gym. We did lose Kuang, that was a bit unfortunate. This is actually a really long episode again. I'm sorry about that. And here's Dawn. Here's Dawn. Hi, Trip. Please, can you come with me? I draw my Pokedex by accident and Team Galactic found it. Now they won't give it back. Please, I need your help. I'll be waiting in front of the warehouse. Warehouses. Please come. And she's gonna go. And basically, we need to go to the warehouse and help Dawn. But we're gonna do that next episode. We're gonna just leave this on a cliffhanger. We're gonna go ahead and go into the Pokemon Center and heal up. Now that actually Zeon lost his, uh, his partner, um, we need to find a female, I believe female, uh, partner for Xeon now. So the next route, we need to find a female for Xeon. So that's, we're going to try doing that. I think, actually, I'm going to go to the box, try cleaning up the box a little bit. Before we end off this episode, this is actually such a long episode. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Full health, there we go. And see you again, there we go. And let's go in here. I, I didn't think he was going to level up on, or not level up, evolve on 27. I thought it was 28, but it's fine. I'm happy, I'm happy. We're going to go move Pokemon. And this box is... Oh, wait, no, we have a ponytail right here. Okay, Mario and the ponytail needs to go into this box. And we're going to rename... Whoops, we're going to rename... We're going to rename this into Barracks. This is the second Barracks. Nope, Barracks. R R A C K S Barracks. There we go. Barely fits. I think that's how you spell Barracks. I spelled Barracks like that too last time. Barracks, barracks. Yeah, I did. Okay, so I'm actually gonna change this to the same to the grass, to the leaf, wallpaper, scenery one, forest. There we go. I, I just want it to be the same. I just want it to be the same. And we're gonna go over here to the dead pile, and we need to drop Kuang off since Kuang did unfortunately go away. So we have Magic and Kuang in here. I'm so I'm so mad that we didn't get to use either of them. But well, actually, I'm not so mad that we didn't get to use Weeping Well because uh, because we do have aces here. But it's still, I'm just really disappointed to lose a member because I don't want to lose a Pokemon member, of course. So I don't, I don't want to lose a member. That's not, that's not how you should go around the game. But whatever, it's fine. So that, this is what our team is looking like at the moment. We do need to find a female partner. I would actually, I would pair up um, Marion with, actually, is, this is, Zeon is a female, right? No, Zeon's a male. Yeah, so we need a female. So I would pair up Marion, but Marion is a male. And you can't pair up two males and a wedlock at the moment. So, yep, we're going to have this episode here. Hope you guys did enjoy this episode. Leave a like right now below if you did enjoy and if you're sad about Kuang's death, let me know in the comment section down below. In the next episode, we're going to help out Dawn and see what that whole thing is about. I don't know what that's about, but we're going to help out Dawn. And hope you guys did enjoy. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe so you never miss a video. Hi, everyone. Have a great day. And until next time, have a nice trip.